office also tells us that one person who was somehow injured during this incident, it's still unclear what actually happened to them. Though. Yeah, and we're still trying to figure that part of it all out. NBC Local 33's Jonah Gilmore is live from the hospital with that part of this story. Jonah. Hey, good evening, you guys. Within the last 30 minutes, we found out that patient was treated and released from Baton Rouge General Hospital um, this evening. Um, it's still unclear on what injuries that person suffered because as we're finding out, that may not have been a shooting today, but we do know that person was involved in that incident at Walmart. Um, as for the identity of the man, we do not know, but here's some things we do know. We know the man was a white male in his mid to late 40s. Again, what injuries he suffered in this whole ordeal is still unclear, but he was here at Baton Rouge General Hospital where he was transported following the incident, and we're told he was treated and released. Now, of course, we'll continue to follow this story and bring you the very latest as it becomes available. Reporting live from Baton Rouge General, Jonah Gilmore, the C-Local 33 News.